We have not always found comfort in killers. We have not always found solace being rocked in the bosoms of those who silently pray and openly destroy. No, not always have we mistaken mimicry for mastery, or pretending for knowing, or enslavement for freedom. But across my memory, across my memory marches millions bold, regal, resilient, confident, unshackled feet stumping up spirits to guide us through this fickle material world. We, we like sun and moon folk, universal souls praying our prayers singing our songs a shu o gun shango ye moja o shun o batala o ya dambala aida we dorora nkango olodumari and yame we know all of you by name we we are people of beginnings of culture of strength not always have we given in to the empty threats and scare tactics of the powerless ones not always have we allowed the blood of our sons and daughters to color the streets while we're walking asleep, marching to the beat of death siren song. They're still wearing their sheets with nooses in reach, showing their teeth and smiling, it seems. But I hear in the breeze, in the rustle of the trees, in the dangling of the feet, they say, please, don't let them ever forget. You see, not always have we suffered from amnesia. Not always have we forgotten how to conjure up spirits, ancestor wisdom, fix up a mixture, spiritual elixir, ancient traditions. We like magicians. God like vision we we are people of sight so no not always have we fallen for this oaky doke or inhale the hazardous smoke of the manipulators or been satisfied with crumbs from meals our hands have prepared Hugh said life for us ain't been no crystal stair but at least the steps are there to push us up higher teach us how to go beyond the destroyers disguises look them in the eyes and be able to see cuz what's surprising when you know the nature of of a beast, and especially when they've shown the same face for centuries. So you tell me, what's the difference between two sisters in New Orleans shot point blank in the back of the head and two women bombed in their car in Baghdad, or government sanctioned killings in Kenya and a sister held hostage in a house in Virginia, or poverty in Haiti, poverty in Jamaica, rape in Rwanda or rape in Somalia, a sweatshop in China or one in Guatemala, or smallpox and blankets, syphilis in Tuskegee, formaldehyde and FEMA, ethnic cleansing and Katrina, I recall within the speech Dr. King made us aware, he said injustice anywhere is injustice everywhere, so they can spare us that drama, huh? We got the heart of them field-working mamas. We carry the torture that ancestor fire, so with every fiber that flutters in our being, with every find that comes from our seeking, with every hearing that comes from our listening, and every sight that comes from our seeing, we must be faithful, strategic victorious and free.